Um, so one of the things I was thinking about, because I don't know, something came up and there was some memorabilia that was like auctioned off and, and it was a ridiculous amount. And, um, and I was just thinking of like, and we're not talking about just like in one genre. We're not talking about just sports. We're talking about any genre. If, if you could afford one piece of memorabilia, like if you were a baller, what would that be? If you could buy like somebody's Rolls Royce or if you could buy somebody's painting or statue or um, like uh, autographed basketball or even, uh, oh, you know what? I, I, I know what brought me to this because Kraft, Bob Kraft, he auctioned off his, his super, one of his Super Bowl rings. So, like, if you could get something like that. So, what, what would be your piece of memorabilia? It doesn't have to be sports. It can be anything. What would you go for? I definitely, I think I'd want a Red Sox ring. You'd want a Boston Red Sox ring? Yeah. From the first one? Yeah. Like yeah, when, when they, they broke, broke the curse? The curse. Yeah. All right. I, I can't. I can't shit on that. Well, only because, like, do you remember? Like, was it the previous year, the snowstorm? Well, I remember the previous year. Uh, it was like during the Yankees. It was the Red Sox Yankees series. No, I, I remember the previous year, two thousand three, when that asshole Brett Boone hit the fucking home run off Tim Wakefield, and just basically shoved our dicks down our throats but um yeah 2004 was pretty sweet but i still wouldn't i still wouldn't go for that i'm going away from sports if to be honest with you i would if if i could afford a piece of memorabilia i would want bill clinton's cigar case cigar holder whatever the fuck it is <laughs> So you can sniff Monica Lewinsky's sniz? No. No. So I could watch other guys sniff Monica Lewinsky's sniz. Because you know every single person I showed it to would do that. Guaranteed. Am I wrong? So, are you telling them that it's Bill Clinton's cigar case? Or are you just yes. handing it to them? <laughs> Excuse me. So, I'm handing them Let's let's say this is this is the cigar case, okay? I'm saying, "Hey, it's happening. I got some something pretty fucking sweet that I want you to look at. Something that is well known Everybody knows about this, but I'm the one who has it, baby. Take a look at this. All right. This is the fucking case. This is the case that Monica, that that Bill's cigar was in. You didn't think he put the cigar in there. No, of course not. He put the cigar case in there. Check this bad boy out. And you're going to tell me these motherfuckers aren't going to be like. <laughs> you're going to tell me they're not going to give it a sniff? No, I, because, we're, because, we're, because, because I don't see you giving them the opportunity. I just see you waving it under their nose like. I might do that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. I might just be like. Oh, yeah. <laughs> check this bad boy out. Take a whiff of that. <laughs> and, and and I might refresh it like with it, it obviously it's gonna go away. So I might refresh it with fucking Hillary's or, or whoever, whatever new little tart I have on online. <laughs> I'm gonna refresh the smell <laughs> just for the story. Just so that it can be like, yeah, whiff on that bad boy. And they're going to be like, oh, shit, it still smells like snizz. 
that's flowers. <laughs> I guarantee you, I, I'll tell you this, I guarantee you I'm going to have dudes be like, <laughs> 